Welcome back to Nylon Theory, and today, on Gear in 90 Seconds, we're going to do a follow-up on the Carnivora 73E. Initial impressions of the 73E weren't great. There are multiple fit and finish issues, including cracked, hollowed pins, pins that weren't long enough, a sharpening chore that was not large enough, improper grinds, and a non-functional edge that was extremely obtuse and improperly apexed. In addition, the blade is insanely thick and almost double the thickness of a K-bar, resulting in an uncomfortably thick grip and an insane behind-the-edge thickness. As a result, the 73E came in at approximately 800 on the best test, which meant that it wasn't able to cut paper or shave. We took it to some Shapton Glass 320 grit ceramic stones, reprofiled the entire edge, fixed the sharpening choil, and it now tests at 310, which means that it's able to shave and cut paper. Aside from this, the main complaint is that this protrusion here, blade catch or thumb ramp, whichever you prefer to call it, makes a thumb forward grip extremely uncomfortable as that digs into your thumb. Whether you're feather sticking, whittling, cutting an apple, this is not going to be comfortable, which makes the jimping up here effectively useless.